Hi guys, how are you? Today I'm talking about Trojan horse virus. Friends, if you are not subscribed my channel, so please subscribe my channel to my latest video update. And if you like this video, so please click on like button. Okay, friends, so let's start. A Trojan horse program had the appearance of having a useful and desired function. While it may advertise its activity after launching, this information is not apparent to the user before and secretly. The program performs other undesired functions. A Trojan horse neither application nor copies itself but causes damage or compromise the security of the computer. A Trojan horse must be signed by someone or carried by another program and may arrive in the form of a joke program or software of some sort. In another way, a Trojan horse is a program in which malicious or harmful code is contained inside apparently harmless programming or data in such a way that it can get control and do its chosen from a damage, such as, such as running the file allocation table on your hard disk. A Trojan horse or Trojan is a file or email attachment discussing as a friendly legitimate like file when executed through the file curves data and can even install a backdoor that hackers can utilize to access the network. A Trojan is another type of malware named after the wooden horse the Greeks used to infiltrate Troy. It is a harmful piece of software that looks like it. Users are typically tricked into loading and executing its on their system. After it is activated, it can achieve any number of attacks on the host from irritating the user, popping up windows or after it is after it is activated, it can be achieved any number of attacks on the host from irritating the user, popping up windows or changing desktop to damaging the host, deleting files, stealing your data, or activate and separating other malware such as viruses. Trojan are also known to create backdoors to give malicious user access to the system. When a Trojan is activated on your computer, the result can vary. Some Trojan are designed to be more annoying than malicious like changing your desktop, adding silly active desktop icons or they can cause serious damage by deleting files and destroying information on your system. Trojan are also known to create a backdoor on your computer that gives malicious user access to your system, possibly allowing confidential or personal information to be compromised. Unlike Viruses and worms chosen do not reproduce by infecting other files nor do they self-replicate. There are two types of chosen. The first is a program or function that is contained in another program. The second is a program that completely replaces a legitimate program. Because chosen don't replicate by themselves, they must be installed on a computer by an outside action, either manually by a user such as clicking on a link and email or by a separate programs. So I hope friends you understand what I am trying to say to you what is the Trojan or virus and if you like this video so please click on like button and please subscribe my channel. Okay friends thank you.